What is up everybody and welcome back to my playthrough of Sonic Battle. <clears throat> so last time Uh last time we We finished up Sonic's episode which you know wasn't that long Sonic found a robot on the beach named it a Merle this Learned a little bit about it, went to Knuckles to get his Chaos Emerald, gave him the Chaos Emerald, and it began to speak, and that's, for bit, that's basically where we left off. So, now we're gonna do Tails' episode. Hey Merle, let's play over by the beach. I'll teach you some secret techniques. Play, play. Uh, Sonic's off to the beach again with a Merle. We still don't know much about a Merle, but I guess it isn't that important to Sonic. There was something odd about a Merle when we inserted the Chaos Emerald, but I can't do any further research because the computer in my lab is broken. Wait a second, I can do a full examination if I use the central lab. I better hurry, I wonder if Emerald is over at the beach. Alright, so looks like we're heading over to the beach. Yep, okay, I just wanted to make sure there was nothing over here, just in case. Here we are, Emerald Beach. Sonic, we need to take Emerald to the central lab. What? We were just getting warmed up. Warmed up, warmed up. Yeah, come and play with us for a little while. As usual, the one who gets 10 KO wins. Ready? Alright, so this time we're gonna play as Tails. Trying to see what... Uh, I think that should be good. Uh, that literally didn't do anything. Oh my god. Alright, so I took out a Merle. I don't know how... I don't know how good Tail just... Ooh, he has pretty decent healing speed. He sure does heal faster than Sonic. That's for sure. Nice. Got two more points. I want to see if I can finish this without a knockout. Oh man, I'm I messed that up. No. All right, check him out. Oh, that didn't work. No! Oh my god. I really do hate that. Like, I like how, you know, I can use it and get like a one hit knockout with the special, but I hate it when, <laughs> when, the, when your opponents use it because you really don't see it coming. And I don't know if you can block those. I mean, I guess if you could block them, they'd be alright, but still, like, it's kind of hard to anticipate that they're going to do that. Uh. 
There we go. Aw, oh, Tails doesn't have a pretty- Tails actually has a pretty decent moveset. So I got the IQ 400 attack. And the windmill. Hey Sonic, we've got to run a full inspection a full inspection on the Merle. We need to find out what it's capable of since Eggman is looking for it. We should take him to the central lab now. Don't stress so much, Tails. Sonic, come on! Sonic! I'll take him there myself if I have to. Okay, okay, Tails, we'll both go with you. No, it's alright. I can take Emerald there myself. Come on, Emerald, follow me. Emerald, let's go. Hey, Emerald, obey Tails. Obey, obey. Emerald, go? Go, go. Hmm, I wonder if I can handle this without Sonic. The central lab is east of this town. It's inside Central City. Now follow me closely. I'll be here, so if you want to practice your techniques again, come by anytime. I'm actually going to do that, just so I can get more skill cards. And so we can get some more skill points. Doesn't hurt to get some extra skill points. Aw, oh, I'm playing the Merle though? What the hell? Well, <clears throat> I did beef up a Merle a little, so he's not that bad to play as anymore. So, like I increased his running, I changed his running, uh, so now he actually does move faster. And I changed like his like slam attack, so now I could actually like do air slam. <clears throat> yeah, so I basically replayed Sonic's story off like camera like after I finished it the first time just to get some extra skill points and uh, yeah I really only did it just to get some extra skill points and some more skill cards that way Emerald isn't like s such so sluggish to play as like right now now he isn't like I wouldn't say he's necessarily like really good but he's like decent enough right basically I have a heavy hitting attack so I'm that's really all I need oh I knew he was gonna do that I'm telling you once once a Merle, once you get a Merle to like basically uh, have better fighting skills, he really doesn't become such a drag to play as. <clears throat> How did that not work? Oh nice, I took both of them out. Let's try to heal, although Merle's not that his healing skill his healing speed is not that good. Wow, Tails knocked me out as I knocked Sonic out. <laughs> Whatever. Uh, so I got Tails style. Which is just his fighting pose. Oh, I got the Sonic Drive. Nice. That's like my first special attack skill. <clears throat> Phew, you've done quite well. I'm here whenever you feel like practicing your techniques. Feel free to try them out here. Alright, well, I think since I got the Chaos Emerald, I know I got more skill points. So, and I got some more so let's see what I can do here. Now, how much is the pose? 15? Oh, so it looks like I was correct. So the stars are basically just a multiple of 5. So that's how you can tell how much skill points 
one card takes up. So like this, the Sonic Kick, it'll take up 15, which is, which means that we'll have like just enough um, to use it. We'll have one skill point left over. Yeah, you see. So let's see here. I really want to focus on improving his attacks first before I do move moving. Just because <clears throat> I think that's important. Moving isn't such a huge priority. Um, yeah, moving isn't such a huge priority. Although I'm looking at this, maybe I can uh, save myself five points by changing to Tails' room. I could do that. Maybe do that. Oh, but I still won't have enough to do it. Okay. That's fine. I'll just leave it like... Hmm. Man, if only I, ha I had like four more points, then I can like completely finish that and have like my full main mo uh, combos attack set, whatever you want to call it. Now where's the Sonic? I think it's ground power, right? Yeah, the Sonic Drive. <clears throat> Alright, so... Uh, we can go to Central City here. And we can go to the lab, which I think we're gonna do that. Just for like... One-on-one... -on -one, just a one-on-one -on -one battle with Tails. Test out our new skills that we picked up. Yeah, so you see... His attack... His attack combo is good, except for the last one, it's like super slow. And then Emerald now runs like Tails. Not as fast as Sonic, but still pretty decently fast. It would be nice to, cha to upgrade his jumping abilities. No! Oh my god. Oh, I need to be careful with that. Just try to heal while he's out. Even though we don't gain a lot, but whatever. Alright, that was easy. Let's just keep juggling him in the air. I can just cheese that. It was like such a cheesy attack move. No! Oh shit. Nice. Can we finish this fight without getting knocked out once? God, I hope so. No! Oh no, it's over. Oh, maybe not. Oh, man. <clears throat> yeah, so, something I haven't mentioned. But, you know, Tails mentioned in Sonic's story that the way Emerald kind of gains the, the capabilities to learn new movesets is through skill points. And the way you get skill points in this game is just basically through battle. <laughs> but it depends on like how good you do and whatnot that determines how many skill points you get. So, you get one skill point for every battle that Emerald is participates in. Whether you play as him, or if he's your ally. As long as Emerald is in that battle, <clears throat> you get one skill point. Oh, I got Tails' heal. Nice. Uh, yeah, you see? Increased by one. And then... Let's see here. 
I'm gonna do a couple more battles just till I get enough to get him to like 110. So, <clears throat> let's just skip all this. Yeah, so you get one skill point for every battle Emerald participates in. You get two if you can finish a battle without getting knocked out once. So that's why I kind of... Oh man. No, let's just quit. I'm not, I'm not really like nuts so far. <laughs> uh, so yeah, you get two skill points if you can complete a battle without getting knocked out once. So that's why I, I really try my best not to get knocked out. But with Emerald's limited skills, it is kind of a little hard. It gets a little easier when he gets better. You could always cheat, like, you know, just cheese the fight too. Like, keep doing, like, an upper attack. That way you don't give your opponent the chance to, like, attack. Um, but, you know, you always have to worry about them pulling, like, a one-hit KO. So, it isn't guaranteed. So far I got three. And then if you can finish an entire battle without taking a single hit, you get five skill points. Now that is like for me that's pretty hard. I guess it's doable. It's actually easier if there's more people involved, you know? Like especially if it's a 1v like a 3v1, cause then you know, it's just you, two allies, versus one opponent. And since you have your allies, you could just kind of like let them gang up on the on your opponent while you just kind of sit behind and just, you know, watch yourself making sure you don't get hit. And, and if, uh, yeah, you could basically maybe finish the fight without a uh, you can finish the fight without taking a single hit and yeah if you're able to do that you get five skill points which is a lot it's hard to pull off so it's not like it's super easy I feel like on one on one it's kind of like a hit or miss because you only have to worry about one one uh, opponent, but you know, yeah, you only have to worry about one opponent. But since it's just one on one, they're always going to be on you, and they could easily get like a cheap shot in if you're not careful, or you know, you're just not lucky enough. So that's how you get five skill points, but that's pretty hard to ma manage depending on the battle. <clears throat> and then you get 10 skill points every time you get a Chaos Emerald, which is the most you can get, but since collecting Chaos Emeralds is entirely dependent on the story, that's just kind of like a fixed value, you know? So you can't expect to get a lot of them. Um, I mean, even then, there's only 7 Emeralds to collect, so that means of the Chaos Emeralds themselves, you only get 70. But if you replay the story, every time you collect the Chaos Emerald, you get 10, so it works, but, you know, it's whether you're really willing to replay the story multiple times. Oh, uh, looks like we ran into one of these. Alright, well, that's fine. Hopefully we can get some skill points here. Oh, and it's only 5, too. Oh my god. My screen just froze. Alright, give me a minute, guys. Alright, I fixed the... I fixed the screen thing. So... I actually fit, found a, a way to kind of like... You know, get around this. Because I know I was having this issue a lot with Sonic Advance 2. Which prompted me to only like play the game with Sonic and so what I realized was like 
I've never done this before. Like, I knew you could do this with emulators, but I never tried it. And that's like, you can... You can, uh... Like... Like, have a save state saved in the emulator itself. And so that's what I do every time my screen freezes or I get a white screen. I just save my point there, uh, like restart the emulator, restart the game. And once I do, and then once I open it up, I just load up the save state and I'm back where I left off with no issues. So I didn't know I could do that. Um, I wish I would have known I could do that with Sonic Advance. Too, that would have saved me like a lot of headaches but oh well you know you live and you learn uh, even then you know if I would have known about that I still probably wouldn't have wanted to do the other character stories you know kind of glad I had an excuse not to do it because I really did not want to play Sonic Advance like the entire run of it four different times or else, if that were the case, I'd probably just barely be doing so playing Sonic Heroes right now. But hey, we're already at a... We're already at a... On um, Sonic Battle, so that's good. Now that we got more skill points, for sure we can now... Do a third attack, and... I can't do Sonic, so... Let's just do Tails, even though it's a... It's a little slower, not that much slower than Sonic's and it's the same power, but hey, at least with that, our main attacks are pretty much good. I got my first attack here, my second, yeah, my second, I got my heavy. See, I don't get this, why is Tails' attack? Uh, take up more skill points here his heavy when Sonic's it has the same power as Sonic's but it's like slightly slower I'd rather just go with the faster one yeah I got my upper attack here all right I got I unlocked the dash attack well I don't got that air attack I don't really need this right now I got my aim attack which I'm I'm using the Shadow Eagle. It's the best one I got. It's the most powerful. And it's the fastest. And then, I don't have any of the specials, but that's fine. So I'd say that's, that's good right now. I think Emerald's really coming into his own. Let's go to Central Highway. Uh, yeah, you know what, why not? Let's, let's go for another round. 